welcome back to another one of my vlogs. So it's definitely morning. It's nearly 25 past six. And it's my first day as my in, uh, in my induction. So I've got three days of 12 hour shifts and I'm really, really excited. So obviously I won't be wearing this Hollister top. Then they'll be sorting me out a uniform, but I'm just wearing it for my walk to work. Um, so I've done my, uh, I've got dress, I've sorted myself out. I've done my skincare. My skin's looking really good at the moment, which I'm really happy about. Um, and yeah, so today is my first day. I'm very, very excited. Also a little bit nervous. I think that's normal. I was nervous with my, f my first day at my new nursery job as well. So I think it's just a normal sort of first day nerves, but I'm really excited. Um, so yeah, got my cereals. Let me get a bowl. There we go. There's apple, uh, apple juice, orange juice, um, which I don't have because I'm finished. Um, I might pinch a little bit of mum's apple juice if she lets me. Um, but mum's made very kindly made me a sandwich for work. Mum, is it okay if I have like a tiny drop of your apple juice to take some paracetamol? Oh, please, I'll only have a little bit. Juice, only a little bit, and then obviously. No, no, it's fine, I've got this used out, so you might use it. Okay, I won't have a lot, no, but. No, because I've been. I'm not gonna have a smoothie probably till the weekend. So oh, okay. I'll I'm just going to let it soak up the milk a little bit because it's quite hard, but I definitely approve of these. They taste exactly the same. I've got my apple juice. I've got my crisps out that I'm going to take with me today. What else? I think that might be it, you know. Um, I haven't been home for that long, really. I finished my shift at eight. I got an Uber home because I just could not be bothered to walk. My first ever, ever 12 hour shift has been done and completed, ticked. Um, it was a lot harder than I ever thought it was gonna be. My eyes have been opened further than I ever thought they would ever be opened. But I do feel a sense of pride and fulfillment for what I have done and for who I've helped. Um, and I do feel like I'm doing something productive with my time. It's day two of induction tomorrow. Um, but it was, as I said, a lot harder than I ever thought it was going to be. I never thought carers had it easy at all. Not at all whatsoever. But I don't think you ever realise how difficult it can be until you're put in their shoes. And I'm glad I've taken on the challenge. We'll just see where it goes. But yes, yeah, so I'm really proud of myself for doing it. Um, the morning was more hard for me. Like, I don't know. I just, because obviously it was my first ever time... And it was just obviously learning so much. And the whole point of induction is to learn as much as possible. Um, and as bank staff, I'll pick up shifts where and as I can. And I'm going to let them know that on the floor that I worked on, that I'm going to want to pick up as many shifts there as possible. The staff are also lovely. It's got such a lovely environment, which I think if it didn't, it would make it a hell. But it's got a lovely environment. It feels so family orientated. It's just brilliant like that. So, yeah, it's day two tomorrow. And yeah, I figured out that I can walk there fairly quickly, really. So I'm going to get there for about sort of like 10 to 8. Just so I've got a bit of time to put my stuff away and then clock on properly. Um, but yeah, so it's day two and I am just completing the long stretch of walk before I get there. I've just been listening to music. Um, I slept chatting my boyfriend because it's his birthday today, the 22nd of April. So yeah it's been really nice and actually i think this walk does me good because i was so tired this morning i really struggled getting up so i felt like i fell asleep so quickly and one mem mom came in to me to save me putting my alarm on literally i just felt like i blinked and i woke up and um, i had breakfast i've got lunch in my bag i've got a bottle of squash because i learned yesterday not having a bottle of squash on you doing a walk like this it's not even like a massive walk to be fair it's just quite a lot of up uphill kind of thing um it's hard work so yeah although today i'm not thirsty for some bizarre reason maybe it's because i've this walk already before um but yeah so oh it's craziness really but i'm excited for the new challenges that today will hold to learn some more skills because i learned so much yesterday it's unbelievable so it's the end of the second day i've got to fill out a form from a friend um this is the soup oh my god cheap affordable full of goodness it is 10 o'clock at night but i need some food in my system saturday the 25th of april and i've got so much catching up on editing to do so i do apologize for lack of uploads but as you may or may not know i've got a new job i am a carer 
which I'm absolutely loving by the way and I've got the weekend off which is really nice so I've literally just slept because I've been so tired um, but my hair is extremely greasy I'm gonna wash it today I'm gonna do some pampering I had a really hot soaking bath last night which really helped with my muscles because my god I was shattered I want to get some bath salts at some point um but so far today I've caught up with people had a chat been on FaceTime to tea I made a couple of orders off Wish because you know why not I got the things that are free but you have to cover shipping I hope you're all keeping safe I hope you're all you know as healthy as you could possibly be and as sane as you can possibly be during this time um, but tonight we're having pizza and wine, which is our Saturday tradition. But obviously some weekends I may be working. Um, so yeah, but um, that is that. And I'm going to get on, I'm going to get myself some lunch. I had a smoothie for breakfast, the frozen pack smoothie, which my mum got from m &S. It was so good. So I definitely recommend those. I do a berry one with oats, which my mum was going to get next time she goes to m &S. Um But yeah. I've literally been asleep on and off today. But I've got this parcel and this parcel to unbox tomorrow. I believe these are the fluffy headbands, I think all three, and then this one is a really exciting um, product that is gifted, it's like this collab thing that's all explained in my um, unboxing video. So I've got half my pizza, I'm having movie night in my room tonight, um, and I've got these movies as options, so this is Juliet, which I love, Mamma Mia, here we go again, which is just brilliant, and Descendants 2. Inject a bit of Disney where I can. I don't know which one I'm going to watch first. I'm going to try and watch two movies tonight. So I want to try and stay awake so then I can sleep and, you know. So it's Sunday and I've just made a list of all the parcels I'm due to have. So I've got blushing cosmetics, three of them. I've got a fragrance collab, a jewellery collab, an Amazon skincare collab parcel um, and one pro product I pay for myself. Um... Pamperporium Big Parcel. Hello Body, I finally made an order on them. Um, from them even. 20 past 12 and I'm gonna have my cold pizza from last night. We were gonna have it with salad, but I'm gonna have mine now and just have a cheese salad later. Um, and I'm gonna have these because I was gonna have last night, but didn't. There's only a few left and I'm gonna use them up. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm an S. Pepperoni pizza is absolutely delicious. Just taking a bite. This was in my movie pile for yesterday, so I'm putting Let's to Juliet on. I absolutely love this movie. Um so yeah, but we've got two Dr. Oak pizzas coming on Tuesday. Um and obviously they're a lot cheaper. You could get two for the price of one MS pizza, but it's for a treat, MS pizzas are so good. So my mum's just gonna quickly leave my floor, but for people wondering why she won't trust me with Hoover, she's gonna show me. But this is a Hoover she's got as a shark. Hoover, you know, if that means anything to anyone, you homebodies. This is what it looks like. Um, but yeah, it's really like compact. You fold it up so it doesn't take too much room in the cupboard and it does a really good job. I've now got some white chocolate and I have got this, which is one of my favourite three film collections. 27 Dresses, Devil Wears Prada and In Her Shoes. I have never actually watched In Her Shoes, but these two movies are two of my favourites. So I'm going to put 27 Dresses on and then I may watch The Devil Wears Prada afterwards. But honestly... I am a sucker for a good chick flick. So I, for the first time all week, all weekend, all weekend that I've been home, is the first time I've sat out here, isn't it? Because yesterday I was just, I was in another world. I was in a little bubble. You can kind of see my uniform there. Um, but yes, yeah, so I am absolutely shattered still. My hair is nice and fresh though. I'm really happy I washed it. I am going to unbox my parcels that I've got so far. I've got so many coming. I've got about 12 or 13 by the end of April, uh, April end of May, I should have. Because obviously there are delays at the moment due to the current climate, which is absolutely fine. Um, I completely understand. Um, but I'm really excited for certain parcels to come more than others because I've got some like collabs. I've got um, just some very exciting parcels and things I've treated myself to. I swear to God, salad is one of my favourite meals. So I've got tuna and oh... I can't wait to eat this. Got 27 dresses on, got my pink gym. And yeah. Oh, it's good. So it's a bit later. I've just done a live video on Instagram explaining about um the Hello Body skincare brand that I'm working with. Um but yeah, definitely follow my Instagram because that's got a lot more information. I also finished my pink gin, which I'm gonna go put in the kitchen. Um but I'm gonna unbox the products um and the parcels I've got. Um, for my unboxing video so keep tuned for that because it will be coming eventually um also i don't know how much i'll be uploading vlogs so who knows when you'll see this but um that is plan oh my god
God, I popped a spot there and it really hurts. Um, I'm going to have Ben and Jerry's in a bit, but I'm going to try and stay up for as long as I possibly can. So I can try and sleep during the day tomorrow um, and chill during the day as well. Um, but yeah, um, so, just because the washing was there. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to unbox those and then, oh, it's just, it's going to be a good So it's now Monday. I've received my very early collaboration parcel. Um, which will be featured in my unboxing video and these which i've all shown in my unboxing video if i'm going to open them with mum they very kindly got me a new pair of work shoes so i've got some marmite toast on camera it looks a lot stronger than it is but i cannot wait honestly and i will show you my sketches so i have some red pepper hummus i've got some tortilla chips um and i've just done an unboxing sneak peek um there i'm gonna have this as a snack and i'm literally gonna chill in bed because obviously i've got a night shift tonight and i don't want to overdo it so I've woken up a lot earlier than planned, um, but I've got myself some orange juice. I've had five hours sleep, which probably isn't enough, but I'm going to go chill in bed. I'm going to have this cross on because Mum's got a food shop today. And then for dinner, which I'm going to have about four o'clock-ish, I'm having the rest of this um, chunky chicken, mushroom and rice soup, which is really nice from M&S. And I'm going to finish my hummus, which is back there as well. You can't really see it, but it's back there. So, oh, no. I've <laughs> oh, God. It's Tuesday. Mine and mum's Amazon deliveries. So I've got my parcel. This is my last Amazon parcel because I took it off my list. So I've got my blushing cosmetics, two of the parcels anyway. So my parcels are starting to arrive, which is just super exciting. Um, but it's brilliant. <laughs> yeah, no, it's not good for the bank balance, but it's great for the soul. Unbox with mum. What have you been buying? This is just a skin cream, actually. Oh, is it? Oh, that's it. Oh, is it Aveeno? Yeah. Oh, Aveeno's really good. It's for the really dry, dry skin. Oh, very nice. So I'm not gonna lie. Now I've got my blushing cosmetics parcels and my Amazon one. I'm going to unbox them because um Ashley, Ashley, <laughs> Ashley asked if I could tell her what has come in the parcels and that she can have that weight off her um, shoulders, which is absolutely fine. Um, but mum has literally been sorting out her parcel and the paper in Amazon parcels. I've never get boxes. I always get them like that. So. Well, it just depends what you order. Peak. This is all the blushing cosmetic stuff that I've got so far. I've got one more package left to come from her, um, which I'm really excited about. Um, but in case you're wondering, I'll be including in um, some of my future giveaways, non-related to her um, brand, but I'm going to be putting some of her business cards, like one of her business cards in, just to help try and promote her business. Um, but yeah, I've got a giveaway which includes these glitters and not that sponge, this sponge, and the winner will get a business card as well. Um, so yeah, and I also got this, which I'm super excited about. Because I've seen so many people have different versions of this. So I just thought part time and it's kind of like a collaboration thing. You'll see pictures over on my Instagram. So I'm all dressed. I've done my hair. I'm just wearing these to, um, to work. And then I get changed into my uniform there. Um, but I've got such an exciting parcel coming tomorrow. Like all my Amazon parcels are here. I've only got one parcel waiting um, to be delivered um, from Ashley, her company Blush and Cosmetics. Which is really, really exciting. Um, and yeah, and then I've got an exciting parcel coming tomorrow, which I would include in my unboxing, but I'm not going to. I'm doing its own unboxing, its own setup. I'm so, so excited. You would have seen on my Instagram, basically, I've got myself an iPad, a new one, because I don't know if I mentioned before, I wanted to get a new iPad and a new laptop, both Apple, obviously. Um, because I just, I'm an Apple girl. I absolutely love their products. So yeah, and I'm getting it on um, a really good payment scheme and I'll explain it all in the video, but I'm really, 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 really excited to get it because I just needed a new one for such a long time. So yeah, I'm very, very excited. Um, I got it off the Apple website and yeah. So I have finished my night shift. It is Wednesday morning and I'm just walking, starting to walk home. It's actually a lot nicer weather than it was going to be. So I'm not going to moan about that. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to... But yeah, so it's really lovely weather. You have a nice fresh walk home. Going to get a bit of breakfast and then I'm going to bed. So I am shattered, but I've got the rest of the day off and tomorrow off. So I can sort out my body clock tomorrow, which is Thursday. But yeah, I hope you're all really well. I hope you're all staying safe. I hope all your families are good. And let me know in the comments how you all have been coping, how you all have been doing during this very strange time. So I'm finally in. I'm christening my duck mug that mum got me years ago from Waitrose. Boiling the kettle. 
going to have in that purse set. Actually, I might just have one, which I forgot. These have two in the ones I got from the pound shop. These are so nice with a cup of tea, honestly. I'm sure you guys know that. But, um, yeah. So, I'm going to... Because it's not too big. And I'm going to have one sugar. And I'll add some milk. Perfect cup size. And for those tea lovers wondering what tea we have, Yorkshire tea. Um, that's what they look like inside. We've got a salad and cold fish cake. Um, we had had a salmon to choose from, so we'll have those another time. Um, my mum forgot I don't like celery, so there is celery lurking in here somewhere. Um, but yeah, I've got Mean Girls on. I cannot wait. And then I might watch Wild Child afterwards. So I finally got out of bed, and it's. 20 to 11 like my sleep pan is honestly screwed but i have got mean girls on pause i have just been doing some sort of like communications over on instagram because kaylee who is such a lovely girl and um, i hope i'm saying her name right um is ah, there is get my ice cream oh because obviously as i said i'm going to talk to you in more depth about hello body and about everything and i cannot wait to get my parcel so i can do a review video for you guys and sort of like show you what they're all about when I've actually got the products to hand. But Kaylee very kindly has checked out the website and she's getting two items. She's using my code, which I'm really grateful for. It's just really nice to support people, you know? And I've got a couple of other people that are gonna message me about it in the morning, which is really good. Um, because obviously I would not promote anything or try and sort of like talk to people about products that I think are shit. Like, I just wouldn't do it. So, I'm really excited for these girls to get their packages. Caitlin, who ordered um, from Hello Body, got her package. And I posted some of her reviews on my Instagram stories. So definitely, oh, definitely check them out if you want to see reviews. Oh, you've got more of your thing. It is caramel. Oh, uh, yeah. No, what? Oh, toffee. Um, I, couldn't, I forgot to get them in Marks. I'll just go. But let's go to Marks right. and I'll get them. But oh, pizza. That's you. Thank you very much. Mum's been shopping. She's got a granola. Pop it on crisps. And that's for me. You've got your... Your special that's for you that's the only one i got oh, they don't perfect. do perfect they Thank only you. do their salty cross on so i didn't get one for myself that's oh, so a chocolate so, oh, oh, lovely have, um, beautiful that's my tv mag oh i'll see some exciting stuff in there so you've got your crisps those are for you thank you very much I'll finish them off first because they're the open ones. Yeah. Oh, you've got two of them. I'll buy them two now because they need to keep going into waitress because of that. Really exactly. Like Save your orange juice. My orange juice or tomatoes. I do love tomatoes on the vine. I think they just taste nicer. Hummus. I've got some cheese straws for oh, today. Beautiful. Oh, m &S. Lovely. That's okay until the 8th of May. So if mm -hmm. I get a soup out, yeah, we perfect. can mix it with. And then I could have a portion of it for... I know I've still got some in the other, but this yeah. is okay till the 16th of That's May. That's perfect, because I don't know how well that will be. It should be fine, it's in the fridge, just try it. And you've got yours? I've got mine. Oh, do I see canned cocktails in there? Yeah, doing three for £5. Oh, very nice. So, I'll take those in the other room. Which ones have you got? Oh, they're both they're all the same. I think that's just got a different. Definitely, yeah. definitely recommend those. We do like them. It's Mine's still in the fridge, though, isn't it? Cause I never oh, yeah, mine it, is yes. as well. We've got both of them yeah. still in there. Very nice. So maybe we could have them tonight. Yes. I just wanted to get those in boots. Is that your Is that a stock coming soon on the online shop? Oh, so I oh, know. Very nice. Oh, I do love them. Honestly, lockdown has made me addicted even more so to the Starburst. Starburst. They remind me of you know our car journey to Cornwall. I've got three. Mum. Three of those. Always and hang on. You know our car journey to Cornwall? Yes. We'd have a Starburst. Love that, we put fruit and veg in those. And oh you've got more smoothies. Do you both have oh. so those have the oats in, so the other one must be the other breakfast one. Okay. I really wanted to try the berry ones and we do like that one. Tropical smoothies. So I definitely recommend the MS sort of ready-made smoothie packs because Holly, who watches this. Never too much fruit um, neither. Exactly. She has recommended me these and we'd actually already got them, so I'm very excited about that. Right, I need to get them in the freezer. Delivery. Um, we have a market um, near us, and my mum and Lynn and grandma actually use religiously for like fresh stuff. But obviously, they're losing quite a few customers because obviously the whole corona and everything. But they're doing delivery service now, which is really, really nice. Um, and they've labelled it and everything, but we've got all sorts in here. It looks so good. 
Oh my god, what's in here? Oh, mushrooms, lovely. Everyone knows I love mushrooms, or if you didn't, you will by watching my lockdown vlogs. Look at those strawberry, my hands are clean. Oh my god. Them, radishes. I've seen so many people posting about their deliveries and stuff of fresh produce, and we haven't had a delivery yet, so now we do, it's great. Blueberries, have them with some yogurt, we've got peppers, sweet peppers, spring onions, bananas in there. Just got lettuce and mushrooms in this one, I believe. Yeah. And then as I said, fresh we've got um onions, sweet potato, carrots, cabbage, broccoli, parsley, I'm gonna say. Um but yeah, this is really, really exciting. Um and it was like twenty pounds for all of this, which is impressive. So it's a lot later on and I've jumped out of the shower and I'm gonna organise this, which is my cupboard that go my cupboard and my like box that goes on my shelf by um, our shower and bath and I've got so many old things in here like this snow fairy is literally so out of date and um, I'm gonna move these move these and stuff like that and then I'm gonna put like bits and pieces like this in here and when I get my new skincare and bath bits so I'm gonna organize this this is the before and this is like the before of this area too because I'm gonna transfer some of these products into my grey box so this is the after I've got hardly anything here now I've just got my Himalayan bath rocks which are really nice the spa bath milk from Superdrug. This smells lush and creates the best bubbles, trust me. This is really good for like when I've done a long 12 hour shift and I've run myself a nice warm bath. Perfect for that. My shampoo, which is from the pound shop, which is nearly empty. I've got a backup down there. Um, my Firmican, um conditioner, which is also from the pound shop. This, which is John Frieda Sheer Blonde Controlled Lightning Spray. I'm gonna get some more of the John Frieda shampoos because they're really good and I wanna alternate my shampoo use. Original source shower gel juicy mango. I wouldn't get this again, like it's good, but I've just got better favourites, you know. But it's cheap for cheap shower gel, you can't go wrong. And then this is what this box looks like now. Let me get it out. Um so in here it will switch off as and when I get new skincare and stuff, um, which I have got, but I will keep some of that in my like, skincare drawers in my room. But I've got my strawberry body polish, which as you can see is starting to run low. Honestly, I use this pretty much every time I use a shower, it smells delicious. My tea tree night treatment gel, which is so good, I'm going to use that tomorrow night after I've had my pamp bath after my day shift. Mini of the Clean On Me by Soap and Glory, mini of the Frosted Berry Shower Gel by The Body Shop, I love this scent so much. The St. Ives Fresh Skin Apricot Scrub. Got this Purify Face Brush, which I'll be using at some point. The Mango Body Yogurt by The Body Shop. I've got the Pore Balance um, Exfoliating Stick from Primark. This is so good, I've raved about that a lot. Hair Mask from the Pound Shop. And my Pore Strips from the Pound Shop. I'm gonna put this in my bath um, drawer, which is in my Alex 9 drawer set. And this I'm gonna chuck, but I'm gonna put it in my empties um, and chuck products. So I'm chucking video, um, so I'll put that in my collection to when I film the video um, later on at some point. I don't know when I'm gonna film it because I'm still collecting products because I just don't wanna use it on my skin anymore because it's just a bit too harsh for me. It was really good, but it's just not a daily wash even though it says you can use it every day. Um, oh, I think that's what that means, I'm not sure. But I think it's an exfoliating one, it's just too harsh on my skin. And this, which is a Snow Fairy Body Conditioner, I love this, I've had it before, but it's definitely out of date and it just, it smells all right, but in the body shop it's lush even. Um, I just don't want to risk it, so they're going to go my empty slash chucking away review video. But that is what that looks like, and I'm really happy with that because I wanted to do it. And it just looks a lot more organised. End of another week in lockdown. It's Friday. I'm just walking to work. I haven't got further to go. Further? I haven't got too much further to go even. Um, I'm going to do my coat actually because I always underestimate how hot I get after walking. Um, so yeah but when I get home today because obviously I decided to stay in bed a little bit longer I wasn't late I just decided to stay and have a bit more of a longer sleep so I got up at half five instead of five um so I will show you the giveaway products for my iPad unboxing video when I get home so I finished my shift I popped to the shop and bought myself a cola um but yeah so I'm just walking home I'm gonna listen to some music in a bit, but I've had a really, really good day. I love, I just love being back at work. And um, I do really feel for you guys that aren't working because of this whole situation. But please, I understand, trust me. I and mean, I'm just really grateful for the fact that I can still work, or I can work now. Um, but tonight I need to edit. I'm gonna have a cocktail with mum, because I've got the day off tomorrow. 
Um, and tomorrow I'm going to organise all my parcels, as I mentioned earlier, um, because obviously I filmed the video now. So I need to pack everything away and just get rid of all the packaging. I hope you can hear me, but I am now home and I'm going to give myself a bath. If you watch my pamper and um, vlogs and where I've done, you know, pamper sessions and baths um, in the vlogs before, you'll know I absolutely love this. So when Super Drop releases again, because they do tend to do this or some sort of thing along these lines at Christmas time. I'm definitely buying. I've been loving these too. This is from the Luck Edit from Ed I've had them a while, um, but they're still perfectly good condition. They're the Pink Himalayan Bath Rocks. This is the detoxifying effect on the body and relieve stress. Oh my god, trust me, as I said, for a good soap, they are perfect. So these were the parcels that turned up for me today when I was at work. They all came at once, which is really exciting. So I've got my Birch Box, which is the Anthropology Collection, which, to be honest, I know doesn't get the most views, but I don't actually do it for the views. Um, I don't do it because I think it's going to be popular. I do it because there are a few that like it and find it helpful. And also, I like looking back on the boxes that I've got, to be honest. I do it more for myself. It's one of those kind of series, as you know. But if you are looking forward to that, then keep your eyes peeled so i'm going to film the unboxing tomorrow i have got my air buds it says on the back which is really exciting i cannot wait to open these i've covered my dress um so i can show you i'm going to unbox these now and then i've got my boots parcel which has literally got dry shampoo in nothing exciting but trust me in days like this dry shampoo i'm going to try and do this handedly which is kind of failing oh it's such a meal it's like the most i'm not sorry for phone users but isn't that the most satisfying noise ever. Can I do this? Right. I've literally battered the box. This is literally all that's in here. Luckily, this can be recycled. Now to unbox my earbuds. If you didn't know, I've got the ice pods, which I will get in a minute to compare. Um, just got my box down there. Um, but yeah, the earbuds came a better recommendation. Customer service is a lot better already. I can tell you that. So they're very quick at responding. Um, I was just a bit concerned about where my parcel was. Obviously, I completely understand there's a delay due to the current situation. But I just wanted to know whether it was on its way and stuff. And the guy replied really, really quickly, which was really great. So let's open this up. So these basically look like perfect dupes of the real AirBuds because um, AirBuds AirPods by Apple because they're literally like look that looks like the same box and everything, which is really, really impressive. Um, so yeah, let's open these up and see what they look like. But that's just what they look like on the front. They've got earbuds on the side, earbuds on the top, earbuds on the side. Um, and that's what it looks like. It just says with charging cable and cake. So opening up, this is what it looks like. Just obviously box standard. And they're wrapped in this, which I will... Oh, look, it says earbuds on it. How cute. I will charge them. I don't know if they're actually trying to be charged, but look at that i'm gonna see whether they do any other cases if these work because you know as you may or may not know my ice pods were an absolute bust um they're in my opinion a con i don't think they're very good and i've actually heard some bad reviews now since buying them so i wouldn't recommend ice pods i may treat myself at some point to the airpods by apple um we're gonna give these a go you know just as a cheap alternative and if they're good then i can recommend these to you guys because they're 29.99 um you save like a bunch of money like they say the offer's only on for 24 hours which is a lie because it's still on now and i got these i ordered these like three weeks ago um not three weeks ago sorry like two weeks ago or something um so yeah but obviously you just press the button there and you've got the airpods like so that'll just char charge the airpods but let's just get them Oh, so the quality is really bad but basically they are charging um the the case is charging the air earbuds now because they have no charge and then i'll connect them to my phone and i'll let you know tomorrow how good it is or um, and then inside you've obviously got that and then underneath you've got the charger cable which you charge the case with if the wireless charger i've got doesn't work but hopefully it will but that's always handy to have so yeah these are charging um, which is really exciting. Birchbox never ever cease to amaze me with their packaging when they do collaborations. Look, and that feels really heavy as well. Oh my god, look at that! How pretty! And Anthropology is supposed to be an amazing brand. So I know the quality is really bad, but I just want to show you this is what happens when you charge it. And obviously, when it's fully charged, it stops flashing. Oh,